APH TV. I'm Jonathan Kwan, the editor in chief at APH Networks. Today we'll be taking a look at the Armor 890 mid tower computer chassis from Thermotake. It is a new case. Now, the funny thing is, I actually didn't expect it to show up on my door, but so it's quite a surprise. But for many readers, it should be a very interesting case uh, due to its low entry price of $90 when it hits the market. And, well, for the rest of the stuff, we've got to look out for our review coming on our website in the next few weeks. But as always in our video previews, uh, we'll be taking a closer look at the chassis. So, yeah, just, just follow along. <laughs> to be honest, I actually really like the design of the Thermotank Armor A90. The front is very visually appealing, in my personal opinion. The use of shapes and lines is very modern, yet certainly not overdone. Behind the front door, we've got three 5.25-inch drive face as well as a 3.5-inch drive face. On the side, we've got two USB ports, two 3.5 millimeter jacks, two LEDs for indicating hard drive activity as well as power status, as well as a reset button right here. Now, where the heck is the power button? It is actually very cleverly located right here. Behind this section of a case is a front intake fan, as most experienced users should be accustomed to. Turn on the case at the top, we can see uh, east SATA port, two USB ports, as well as an exhaust fan right here behind this vent opening. <laughs> uh, actually, uh, on the side, we've got, a, again, a fairly interestingly designed side panel. There are various trapezoidal shapes embossed into the panel. In the middle is a very small triangular window. Ah, uh, yes, that's, that's the right word. <laughs> uh, right here is a mesh for accommodating one 120mm fan for either intake or exhaust, depending on how you configure it. That is fairly simple. The main thing you'll see is that the Thermotank Armor A90 has a bottom-mounted power supply bay. Open the case up. Uh, the thumb screws are on both sides for the user's convenience. We will see that the entire interior actually has, or the entire interior is actually fully painted to add a little more class to the chassis. There is an opening behind the motherboard tray for users to access after heat sinks with aftermarket backplates, so they don't need to remove their motherboard when changing the heat sink. All in all, I'm a fairly big fan of the case. The biggest complaint I have per, for my personal preference is that. The side panel right here, I much prefer a full window rather than something that's not like this. I, again, like I personally have a problem with even the embossed shapes. It actually has a lot of interest, interesting, but I really don't prefer having a side fan because personally I don't really find much use for it most of the time. The top also has a exhaust fan for improved thermal management, but again, I'm not a big fan of it because putting fans at the top of the case definitely would introduce more dust into the system. Again, these are mostly personal preference, but do look up for a review on website schedule in the next few weeks. Again, this is a video preview of the Thermotank Armor A90 computer case. Do for our... Yeah, I'm not very good today, so... Bear with me, uh, for the actual review, do look out on it for, do look. <laughs> for the actual review, it will be posted on our website in the next few weeks, do look out for it. Uh, for if you have any questions or comments on the Thermotech Armor 890, please drop by our forums at http colon slash slash aphnumbers.com slash forums. For the rest of the review collection, please visit us at aphnumbers.com. Again, uh, I'm Jonathan Kwan from APH Numbers. Thanks for watching.